Hello and welcome to the JBM Sports Fanatic channel. Thank you for watching for another video. And today we're going to be discussing Mark Ingram joining the Houston Texans. Um, this move makes sense since obviously the connection with head coach David Culley, who's just leaving the Baltimore Ravens. So it makes sense. Obviously, last year was not Mark Ingram's best year by any means. He actually saw himself fell on the depth chart in a rather crowded backfield with J.K. Dobbins and um and Gus Edwards essentially getting the bulk of the carries in that rotation. And so um, two years ago, he obviously was the man down there in Baltimore. So he obviously, you know, there was a lot of injuries going on. And so many things in which nobody would know that better than David Cully himself. Obviously, for him to make this move, he believes that, you know, Mark Ingram can return to perhaps his 2019 form or something closer to that. Um, we've seen Mark, you know, have a lot of success with the New Orleans Saints prior to that. He's 31 years old. So, you know, him and David Johnson, they're pretty similar in terms of the um, age. And so he'd be a, a good compliment to try to be more of a physical running back, you know, whenever they need that. You know, obviously the Houston Texans decided to part ways with Duke Johnson um, in, towards the end of last month. So it makes sense that they bring him in, you know, see what he can do. He was a beloved teammate um, throughout both teams, you know, whether we're talking about with the Saints, you know, his relationship with Alvin Kamara or even, you know, just with the Baltimore Ravens, you know, both teams, they spoke high of him in the locker room. So he's a great leader and locker room presence. And so this deal right here definitely makes sense. Um, it's going to be up to three million um, next year, so that's um, great for him. You know, I'm pretty sure there's going to be some um, incentives, um, probably based upon you know the amount of touches that he get, but um, he'll be able to make up to that three million. And so it's definitely um, a move that is going to have some impact for this franchise. I expect them to bring on an additional running back just to be more of that pass catcher out the backfield, you know, in addition to obviously David Johnson, you know, he can um, catch, but, you know, um, injuries, you know, tend to get the best of him as well. So I expect them to bring on another running back that can perhaps come in and get some carries as well. But I expect Mark Ingram to compete to get the um, second um, most amount of carries with that offense and I like the move, you know, it's low risk, potentially a good, decent amount of reward. We'll see how that plays out. And if things doesn't work out, it's just a one year deal. So um, thank you so much for watching. And as things continue to unfold, I'll be sure to continue to make these videos.